is a wave that travels through compression. As it goes past, pressure rises and it lessens. The amplitude refers to the changes in strength, and the distance between wavelengths is called the wavelength. Usually the frequencies stay the same, but when something is moving, you'll hear a change called the Doppler effect. When the source and the story move to each other, the pitch goes up. The Doppler effect. When the source and the story get farther apart, then the pitch goes down, down, down. If the observer moves away from the source, they hear the waves at different times, of course. It takes longer for each wave front to hit, so the frequency is lower, and so is the pitch. When they get closer, it goes up instead, because each wave front is heard slightly ahead. That's the Doppler effect. When the source and the server move toward each other, the pitch goes up. The Doppler effect. When the source and the server get farther apart, then the pitch goes down, down, down. Now, if the source moves away from the observer, every period starts a little bit further. Early wave fronts get a tiny head start, so the troughs and crests get farther apart. Wavelength goes up, pitch goes down. If the source gets closer, turn that around because the Doppler effect. When the source and the server move to each other, the pitch goes up. The Doppler effect. When the source and the server get farther apart, then the pitch goes down, down, down. If everything is moving, it gets more complex, but usually things act how you'd expect. You can figure out what happens without much frustration if you plug in values into this equation for the, the Doppler, Doppler effect. effect. When the source and the server move to each other, the pitch goes up. The Doppler effect. When the source and the server get farther apart, then the pitch goes down. The Doppler effect. When the source and the server move to each other, the pitch goes up. The Doppler effect. When the source and the server get farther apart, then the pitch goes down.